Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So, as you have seen from the title of this video, something interesting is taking place in build 26,200 in the Canary channel, which was the latest preview build that rolled out um, late last week. And I posted on that, and that video will be in the end screen, where the Windows loading circle and boot screen does not appear when booting up the operating system after upgrading to build 26,200 in the Canary channel. Now, this was spotted by Zeno over on X. And if we just have a look at this little clip provided, yeah, we can see the whole process in operation. And it's not just Zeno who has spotted this. There are reports that there are other insiders who are also saying that their system won't boot up without showing the Windows 11 loading circle. So there's one or two things taking place here. This could be Microsoft testing, um, not including the loading circle and boot screen in the OS for whatever reason, because obviously the Canary channel is very early days where a lot of the so-called new changes and features are tested. And also the, the whole process of missing the loading screen and loading circle means the OS boots up a lot quicker. Or this could just be a bug, which I tend to think it is. Um, the Canary channel is very early days. So obviously um, there's a good chance I would suggest that this is a bug and Microsoft will not be removing the loading circle because the loading circle is basically one of those um, iconic features of the Windows OS that's been around um, forever in the OS. And I don't think Microsoft would ever deprecate the loading screen or the boot screen. Um, I think it's too much part of the OS and a familiar site for a lot of um, Windows users. But nonetheless, that's um, something that was spotted in the Canary channel. Other Microsoft is testing removing that, but personally, I think it's a bug. And it's going to be interesting to see if by next week or this week, actually, they have fixed that. But obviously, if I get any info, I'll keep you guys posted. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.